John Strohmeyer here with Strohmeyer Law. Today, we're going to be going through some of the common questions we get from potential clients about estate planning, probate, and tax law. You've received a check in the name of somebody who has passed on. What can you do? Well, that check actually belongs to the decedent's estate. Even if you're the sole beneficiary of the estate, you'll need some legal authority to make sure that you can put that in your bank account. If Bill Smith died and you're the only beneficiary of the estate, you're not going to be able to take that down to your bank and deposit the check until you have some authority. Typically, you're the executor of the estate or you're the administrator of the estate. That is going to have to be negotiated over to you. So somebody who is allowed to sign on behalf of that check is going to have to sign that check. Some cases you may be able to get the check reissued in the name of the estate or perhaps the heir or beneficiary, but in most cases it's going to have to go through the probate process where it's able to be used to repay any remaining creditors before it can be paid out to a beneficiary. Some checks do have time limits where they're only going to be good for 90 days or 180 days. If you've got a check like that, you're going to want to get that taken care of as soon as possible. But having a check that's going to expire is not going to be a reason to really push you to the front of the line with any of the probate courts. If you're going to have to go through the process, they're not going to say, well, we've got to get this check negotiated in the next few days. Let's move you to the front of the line. They're going to make you wait just like everybody else. So if you've got a check in the name of somebody who is no longer alive, you're going to need some level of probate process before you're able to deposit that check in your own bank account. Thanks so much for watching. If you've got other questions about this, go ahead and leave a question in the comments below. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.